so this is the uh, error we are seeing here the partition pbl and the partition pit checking flash memory are failed okay so today i'm going to show you you how to fix these two problems okay this is samsung galaxy tab 3 3g uh, 3.07 uh, sm t2 double one first of all you need to get to the download mode okay uh, i think you know that by pressing the volume down key the home button and the power button at the same time but the problem is in this case but uh, that we are unable to get into the download mode so i'm going to show you how to get into the download mode okay <coughs> let it be rebooted first then select reboot just be quick and press these two three buttons okay you can see here the backlight is on as you can see here but nothing is shown actually it is in the download mode right now okay you just press the up button there you go you can see there it is in the OD mode right now okay actually the problem with the display it doesn't display the download mode so you are unable to see that okay now I'm going to just <coughs> connect my data cable with my PC okay Now you have to download this software Odin 3 version 3.07. Okay, run that. I've given the download link in the description. Okay, here you can see the device is detected. Okay, now uh, we're I'm going to fix it by flashing the custom ROM. The custom ROM, I have downloaded it. I'm going to show you. That is okay. That is in the. This is the download. Uh, this is the custom ROM. You can see. Okay. Uh, tar dot tar dot md md5 file. Okay. That is about 1.4 GB. After extracting, before extracting, the size is about 812 MB. You can get it from sammobile.com. I will give the download link. In the description okay now <coughs> just open the Odin software click on PDA browse your file that's stock room okay that file select it it will take some time to detect wait for this Do not worry if the software is shown that it not responding. Just leave it at its state. Okay, now you can see that uh, the PDA file is now detected. Here you can see add it. Okay, add it now. You just have to flash it. Okay. Now make sure that repartition is not clicked, only auto reboot and F reset time is clicked. Okay. Now uh, I'm going to press the start button. Let's see what happens. You can see uh, the stock room is installing now. Here. Recovery. The recovery part is installing. 
you can see here the download has started okay this will go full the download will full okay <coughs> Now you can see the installation process is complete and the tab 3 is uh, rebooting. Okay. You can see the blue bar that it is initializing. You just wait and it will reboot. Samsung logo has appeared. <coughs> That's all for the best. It will take some time. Just wait. There you go your uh, Samsung Tab 3 now is back ok with the uh, 4.4.2 KitKat version ok you have to just start now thank you for watching the video and please subscribe and like the video thank you